hello friends today i'm going to show you how to create a read only server role by because uh, uh, we don't have any roles with read only permissions so if we select that we, that will uh, give the certain required permissions to that user but for that uh, we don't have any data read only at server level why because you you, got, you have recruited one new person and you have to give the uh, read only permission on all databases for example if you, if you want to do that you need to go to the databases and you need to select data reader permissions on database level so it is not possible to do everything like this for example if we have 100 databases so it is not possible to give, go to the every database and give select the uh, user and give the permission so it is not good practice and good uh, it is not a good uh, approach to that so to achieve this we need to create a server role with read only permissions with all securables so let us do that first i am going to create one uh, uh, server role with uh, name as a read only and i am granting connect permissions and all the user securables within the databases to read only for example just select that all the script and uh, click execute here the, the second step is and create login so, uh, create a login with password already exit right mm. Okay, no problem. To select alter server role read only. Yes. Now I am granted read only permission to the test user. Okay, right. Go to SQL Server, refresh once and see security logins. Other test user is created. Very good. And go to server roles. Read only server uh, server role has been is created. It's good. Now time to check go to uh, administrator login with test user ok 123 password yes now here uh, I have uh, one six databases now if you select that you can that read only permissions can view any roles right select so for example if you try to add any role tables or any data it will prompt error let's check it see here you can see the warning messages you are logged or not as database administrator you will not be able the permissions even if you click yes it will allow to type the data but when it come to try when it comes to save it again it wants for warning see here you can see warning Okay, this is how you can achieve the read-only permissions at server level. This script will be given in the description. You shall have a nice day. Thank you.